Jamie, did you ever watch that show, The A-Team? Sure. All right. Which character from The A-Team do you think I most closely resemble? Which one was that guy that keeps ending up in the mental institution? Murdoch. That's Murdoch. That's the one. All right. Well, we have an entire episode devoted to the 80s cult classic, The A-Team. Go on. We will be trying to disable a car with a manhole courtesy of a sewer explosion. The myth is that by placing the dynamite just inside the drain, the A-Team could evade the villains without injuring them. For some reason, urban areas don't like it when you use explosives in their sewers. So in lieu of that, we've come to our favorite place in California where we can blow large things up and even dig holes in the ground. I own California. Thanks to its remote location, I own is the perfect place for some manhole mayhem. They don't ever want to kill the bad guys. They just want to neutralize them as a threat. Yep, to put the A-Team's MO to the test. Next, the guys need a city sewer. Nothing like digging a good trench. To see if the same blast, but just barely underground, will be injury free for all. With the trench plates in place, the guys next man up their manhole. Hello. And after a quick sewer survey, ah, uh, yeah. The great backfill can begin, as Jamie buries most, but not all, of their sewer system. Keyword system. Sewers are part of a long set of catacombs running underneath the city. There's a lot of places for the expanding gases of the explosion to go, and that is why we're leaving ours open. With one end open, one end closed, and the top soon to be sealed shut, their drain in a day is done. After that comes the dynamite, positioned millimeters below the manhole at the very uppermost point of their drain. So this is exactly what we see them do in the clip. Nine sticks of dynamite off to the side of bit with the manhole cover on top of it. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Explosives in the manhole cover in three, two, one. That did it. Wow, I... that was awesome. When the dust settles this time, it's clear that the car hasn't been torn apart. It's an astounding result. Simply by placing the dynamite millimeters below their manhole, the shockwave takes out the car and the car alone. This is really cool. 95% of the time, what you see in movies and television has no bearing on actual physics. So it is very funny to me to delve into a cheesy 1980s action show that I totally grew up on and find that their physics are sound. That is, putting dynamite inside a manhole is a fine way of making a non-lethal explosion that will take out a car. So how do you want to call this one? Well. I think the A-Team's plan was an excellent plan. I'd say it's plausible.